What is the YouTube? I am RJ Tech Reviews here, and today I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna do a bit of a review of my Western Digital on. First up, design. So you pretty much got the standard Western Digital logo on the front, the Western Digital plated watermark, and on the back you have the My Passport, and if you can see clearly, got the, the link to the website. And Closer look at it. Yep, it's the this link at the website. It's, to, it's some serial writing in the link there. So that's pretty much it. The design is a block or the line. You can't really open it to see the design. So you see what's inside. Pretty sure on the solid state drive. <laughs> um, you have the actual. <laughs> Came, you have the memory controller that controls the hard drive, the circuit board, and the chip that stores your data. So that's how it works. And next up, we have the cable that actually comes over it. Forgot about that. Yes, the hard drive comes with a very short cable that plugs directly into the computer, like any like any ordinary external drive. And for some reason, um, you can't really bring one of these things to school and to plug it in. Um, for some reason, I don't have a tripod, so screw it. So I'm gonna try my best. Plug it in, there you go. So there you go. I know it's very difficult to maneuver on one hand. But there you go, that's how you still plug it, it plugs right in. And I'm gonna take it to the computer and I'm gonna see what's in my hard drive. But we're, we're, I don't know if we can go to that in a second. So three, two, one, signing off. And now to the part where we plug the hard drive to the PC. Now this is my de this is a very decent laptop, and that's my Twitter over here. If you guys can follow me, it's GF is at GFX underscore game. Now to plug in the hard drive is like is like any ordinary USB, and let me just plug in my my microphone as well. Um, I very difficult one hand. So it's like any old fashioned YouTuber will do. And there you go. So we already have my mic plugged in, just prepared to record on the desktop. And let me close this out. So I'm not gonna have time to be able to look what's inside this hard drive because as expected, because I'm about to go to bed and I have to edit this. So, so yeah. There you have it, my, uh, my passport. If you really wanna prove that this is four terabytes, let me show you right now. If you go to File Explorer, uh, this should have been done with a screen recorder. Because this PC is usually of um, a, 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 a Rhino disk originally. It does, it does come with software bundled with the hard drive, but I managed to delete it afterward. Because really, there's really no point keeping that thing on an external drive where you have Windows backing up your drive. If you click on it, and this is just proof that I have an external drive. Now, it should have to clean up this one over here, so. Because it's about the chance to almost reach it of a, a, a terabyte. So, as you can see, it has 359 terabytes out of 63.63, which I don't know why Windows allocates it. It says 4, but it's actually a exactly 3.63 terabytes. And it's plugged into the computer because that's how Windows actually allocates their hard drives. It goes by that standard number. But anyways, I'm gonna wrap this up. So I am Arch Jefferson's Tech Reviews, and this is Arch Jefferson's Tech Reviews. Signing out.